And YouTube, it's your boy DIY, the Trucker G. Hey, what's going on? What's going on, people? It's your boy right here, J Quill. <laughs> All right, YouTube, we got you. The video coming today. So today, what we're gonna do is we're gonna change this line right here that I took off already. This line right here goes for the fifth wheel. Goes right up in there. I'm gonna show y'all. It goes here. So we're looking at that piece there, and I got this. All right. So this right here is bad and damaged. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this out. Well, we're gonna leave that alone. This is damaged. This is old piece. We're gonna run with this. The hose is a four inch. All right, so. And this right here, the same thing. So what we're gonna do, we cut the tip, cut the tip. No, we ain't gonna lose this, but we're gonna use this here. So I'm gonna have to take off all of this. So I'm gonna have to push these in right here and pop them out and run this line back there. But I definitely gotta use this. So a quick little video, teach you something that's how to change, show you how to change the line from the fifth wheel. right there so that goes in that hole right there you gotta focus a little bit but it goes right up in there and it goes to next to this so let's get it together real quick all right so we get that together let's see if we can focus a little bit in there there you go that's what we're gonna do Yeah, appreciate y'all watching. Make sure y'all hit the like button. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Hey, we'll wait for new, new content to come, all right? So we gotta do this right now. Pretty much all you gotta do is take this and push this piece in. Push in and pull the line out. Push it in, hold it. There you go. That piece there. And all we're gonna do with this, well, see it's split, so I wanna cut it. Oh, it's already cut, there you go. So all you're gonna do now is just stick it in the hole. That's it. Make sure you, make sure you get a, a good shove up in there. Shove it up in there, that's it. Then take this metal piece and screw that up in there. Uh, we got grease everywhere, we ain't worried about it. Mm -hmm. That's in there like so. All you're gonna do now is stretch it across. Break it here. That's it. So we're gonna have to try to elevate that a little bit, keep that from rubbing. So we're gonna connect those two together. All right, so put that there. Quick, quick fix here. Quick fix. All right, so what we're gonna do is back out a little bit. Just see what I'm doing. Quick little video. It's this video just how to change a damaged line, because this right here, from sitting on there damaged, I'm gonna show y'all what it is real quick. But sitting on there rubber, this is what you're gonna get. Those flat spots, this is exactly what you're gonna get. And it's gonna start leaking out of there, so it's gonna cause the fifth wheel not to slide for you. So put that there. Take the other one out. You can save these pieces here. I said, push it in. Push it in. Push the holes in. Grab that. That's it. Cut that piece there so it ain't leaking. So you're going to get that bag from KW. 
So it's gonna come with that one. There you go, right there. It's the part that's gonna come in right there. So if you're getting it from KW, it's pretty much it's sliding the fifth wheel, call you airline holes. That's all it is. Alright? Original part. So that's all we're doing here. So I'll post everything down in the link. I'll come with the rest of the little fittings, the tools, everything. Alright? But I have to use the old stuff because I don't have everything in here. So Alright, so I want to go ahead and get something to cut that tip real quick and shut that in here. So other than this, we're not gonna put that on. We're gonna go with this, this um this one fourth right here and put that in. Alright, so let's do it. Cut the tip right there, get a razor blade. job in the, in the crazy here so what you want to do is cut the tip off that grab it here cut it that's it grab this new piece I'll put the part number in the, in the description and um, you ain't you don't need no type of w40 all you gotta do with this is just stick it in there Make sure it's a snug fit. That's it. It ain't gonna come out. I'm gonna do the same over there. Take this little piece, put it here. That'll just sit there. Detail reasonably, nothing other than that. All right, so what we're gonna do now, we gotta um, cut this piece here. So I'm gonna put it here. And just cut it where you get it flat. A little bend in it. There you go. Up here, might even run the hair just so I can zip tie it. All right, so what we can do with this might just run this on the hair, zip tie it here so I don't have to rub anymore. So I'm gonna go with that. So, what we're gonna do just so I can get it from there. All right, came out. Under oh, on top of man. with it now nah, I stay on top just got to build a bracket later stick it in here pull that back a little bit stick it in there and that's it got it on that's it and then all I'm gonna do really I zip tie this here so it don't move and put some under there that's it and go in here start the trucker real quick let the air pressure raise up Hopefully we get those jars to move. All right, let's start this up real quick.
right there, bro. I'm gonna do it. Put this under here. Bro. That's pretty much about it. I, just put a, I gotta make a bracket so the bracket can sit up here. So once you make the bracket, that's pretty much about it. I'm gonna go to it. Bro. YouTube, make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe. We done with this video. I'm out of here. Get at me, get at y'all later. We out of here. Hit that like button. We gone. Peace.